Hi, I'm Zach Metzinger, Product Definer with Maxim Integrated, and I'm here to demonstrate the error correction code feature of the Max32670 microcontroller. Let's get to the demo. Here in the lab, we have a Max32670 error correction code demo set up on the bench. We will be demonstrating the ECC functionality of this device. The IC has been modified by removing the top plastic encapsulation to expose the die. This is necessary as the source used in this demo emits alpha particles. These particles have sufficient energy to cause random bit flips in static RAM memory, but would not penetrate the plastic top of the IC. The image displayed on the top of the LCD is held in the Max 32670's SRAM and updated each time the yellow LED blinks. Just below the picture, we can see the elapsed time in seconds, number of detected errors, and whether error correction is enabled or disabled. When an error has been detected in the SRAM, the red LED blinks and the speaker clicks. We will now place the alpha particle source to start the demo. After placing the source, we begin to hear the familiar Geiger counter sound and observe that the number of detected errors increments. Note that the picture is not affected by the alpha particle strikes on the SRAM, as ECC has been enabled and is correcting single bit errors. Now we will repeat the demo with ECC disabled and observe the effect. Almost immediately, we notice random pixels within the picture have changed. These strikes represent SRAM data corruption caused by alpha particle strikes. As time goes on, more and more pixels are affected. Since this process is random, a time-lapse sequence was recorded which shows a one-hour run. On the left, the demo is set to correct errors, while on the right, errors remain uncorrected and visible in the picture. This demo proves that ECC is a valuable feature when data integrity could cause downtime, loss of revenue, or operational safety concerns. Well, that's it for the demo of the Max32670 error correction coding feature. For more information, check out Maxim Integrated's website. Thanks for watching.